All right, back on the V to the moon. The Crypt Crashers pack. So I got this pack gifted when it first came out a year ago by my friend Matt, because I made a joke and I said he wouldn't gift me it because it was expensive. When in doubt, he gifted me it. But anyways, so this pack is 2,800 V bucks. So in this pack, you get the Midnight Dusk, which you do get two out of cells for her, the glasses on, glasses off. The Batty Pack for the Dusk, the Vamp Act for the Dusk, and then the Arcane Corcher, I think that's what it's called. I don't know. And then the Arcane Tote for the Backling, and then the Web Spinner's Slice Pickaxe. And then the Night Surf Bomber with the edits off of the glasses on, glasses off. The Fire Breathers Day Pack, and then the Dark Days Pickaxe. All that for 2800 um, I have nothing else to say. Let's get into it. All right, gamers, before you continue watching this video, remember to subscribe, like, comment, share, and check that description. Go follow me on TikTok, Instagram, Twitch, Twitter, and check out my Discord server and everything down below. Now back to the video. All right, so here's the Midnight Dust skin with the Vamp Axe pickaxe. Pull up. Swing. So, like I mentioned, this is 2,800. It's more like a pack, like a um, money pack, but you pay V-Bucks, kind of like the uh, double agent pack. That's a good example. The other pack that just came back too, that I already reviewed, um, and stuff like that. Um, it's not a money pack. It is a V-Buck pack, but it is a limited time V-Buck pack. It's a Halloween exclusive, just so you know. There's your opponents. I can hit them. It's a basic pickaxe, nothing crazy. Very basic. Has some typing sound, but you know, nothing crazy. Let's do a little ADS. This is good. I don't know what you really expect here. Nothing's crazy here. Alright. It's a little shield. Slurp. Splash. Fish. Bandages. Mini. Big shield. Med kit. All right, so a little gliding with the one shot glider. Hello, forward, back, left. Right, not moving. All right, so a little building. All right, so Primus, you see the front and the back of the skin. So yeah, it's a very basic skin. I think it's the best skin in this bundle, pack, whatever you want to call it. I think all the other skins kind of suck. Um, I didn't really like this bundle. I just wanted to see if he would give me it, and yes, he did. Um, but I think this skin is actually pretty damn solid. This is a pretty good skin. I think everything else in this bundle is kind of weak. Um, yeah, personally for me, I think everything else is very weak. Uh, this skin is the uh, show stealer here for me. Um, but yeah, it's a good skin. Very basic, very simple. It looks good. Um, I hate the original Dust, but I actually like this one a lot um, more than the original Dust. I do not like the original Dust at all. Let's take the backwing off. 
and we'll show off the edit style. It's such a basic edit style, but I will show it off. It's just take the glasses off. It's really nothing. I like the glasses on, personally. You can't even see it, ADS. You're gonna only see it if I do Primo. Like, barely. Barely. You barely see it. But, uh, yeah. Let's, uh, switch over to the next skin. Let's do it. Alright, so here's the Night Surf Bomber with the Dark Days pickaxe. Pull up. Swing. Like I said, all these pickaxes are very basic. There's nothing crazy going on here. There is some lot of an impact here with the poof. But, you know, they're still, like, basic. And kind of purple there, too. But, you know, it's still basic. Nothing really crazy. Um, that's why I say this pack isn't anything spectacular. There's a lot in here, but none of it's really, uh, you know, or crazy or amazing. I think it's fine for what it is, but you know, the price compared to what you get here, for me, personally, is really not it. Noise is pretty good, though. Alright, let's do a little ADS. Whoa. Whoa. ADS is good, what do you expect? Bandages. Splat. Mini. Fish. Slurp. Big shield. Make it. All right, so a little gliding. We got the one shot glider. Pull up forward, back. Left, right, not moving. All right, let's do a little building. All right, two primers. You see the front and the back of the skin. All right, so basically this is just, what, what do I compare it to? Uh, what's her name? Dark Bomber. Um, just a different version of Dark Bomber. That's what it kind of gives me vibes of. Um, I don't think it's bad, but compared to the other one we just saw, uh, the Dusk, I think is, this one's kind of sucks. I think this one's the second best of the pack. We'll get to the worst one. I'll tell you why it's the worst one. But this one's not horrible. I think it just looks kind of funky. And we already technically have the skin because of Dark Bomber. I think Dark Bomber is just a better interpretation of this. Um, so if you want something like this that's a little bit cheaper without buying everything else, buy Dark Bomber, realistically. Um, let's take the backlink off. And she does have an edit cell, so we will take that. Glasses off. That's all it does. So this is what she looks like with no backlink. Nothing crazy. Same with no glasses. Let's do Primo. Like I said, very basic, nothing crazy. But uh, yeah, let's quickly cool switch over to the last skin of the bundle. All right, so here's the Arachne Corcher with the Web Spinner Slice. I hope I'm saying that right. Pull up. 
swing. Alright, and basic. Pick up. Right. Like I said, I think we've already surpassed the best skin in this bundle, and this is the worst. Personally for me. Two opponents. All right, let's do a little ADS. ADS is good, we can expect. A little bit of shield. Flirt. Splash. Bandages. Fish. Mini. Big shield. Medkit. Chug drug. All right, still a little bit of gliding. the one shot pull up forward back left right not moving all right still building okay stop lagging again thank you all right, let's do Primus. You can see the front and the back of the skin. And I'll tell you why I think this is the worst thing in the bundle. So, it just looks weird. Look at her face. Just look at her face. That's all you have to do, and this just ruins the skin for me. Um, the skin just doesn't look that great, um, personally for me. It looks kind of funky. It looks un uncanny. Uncanny Valley. It looks too happy-go-lucky for a Halloween skin for me. Um, I think Dust looks pretty evil. I think um, the Dark Bomber looks pretty evil. My biggest problem with Dark Bomber is it's basically a reskin, you know? We've had a bunch of Dark Bombers, and that's my biggest problem with the Dark Bomber. This just looks weird and fucked, like, really. It looks just weird. It doesn't look right. Look at her face. Ugh. This is my fucking personal opinion on that. Let's take the back wing off. And that's what she looks like with no back wing. All right, let's go to Bell Ops. I'll play you. Should you buy the Crypt? Crasher pack bundle, what do you want to call it? Let's do it. All right, so about all now. So, you, should you buy the Crypt Crasher pack bundle, whatever you want to call this? So, this is 2800. You get the Midnight Dusk with the edit style, the no glasses and the glasses. The Batty pack, which is for the dusk, is you get the Vamp Axe for the dusk. You get the Arcana Courture, I think that's how you call it, um, with the Arcane Tote and the Web Spinner's Slice Pickaxe. And then you also get the Night Surf Bomber with the default edit style, the glasses on and the glasses off edit style, and the Fire Breather's Day Pack, and the Dark Day's Pickaxe. All that for 2,800. So should you buy this bundle? Uh, it's a toughie. Um, this one I think is good in some cases and bad in some other cases. I think the color scheme is spectacular. The color scheme is great. Purple, pink, black, great color scheme here. Um, if you like those colors, and I like those colors. Um, my problem here 
is there's a lot here that just isn't that good for me. Um, the two skin, there's three skins in this pack. For me, only one of them is good. This one right here. This is the peak of the pack for me personally. I think it just looks the best. It's the cleanest out of all of them, and it doesn't look weird or hideous. Um, I hate the original Dusk, and they improved on it. For me, reskins should improve or change the skin enough to make you like it more. I didn't really like the original Bright Bomber, and that's what Dark Bomber did. It made and improved on the skin. So that's what a reskin for me should do, which I don't like the original Dusk at all. I think she looks weird and hideous, but this is pretty solid. Um, my biggest problem with this pack is the Arcanian, Arcanian whatever, the uh, Spider Lady, whatever her name is. Um, I think is a downgrade compared to the original one that we had in the item shop. I think it just looks weird and looks funky to me. Uh, and then the Nightshade Bomber, Night Surf Bomber, the Dark Bomber clone, or the Bright Bomber clone, if you want to be specific, I think is just stupid, you know? We already had Dark Bomber. I don't think we need another Dark bomber S skin. Um, it's kind of like the um, Haze reskin we had. With that one, it's kind of on the same line as that. But at least the Haze reskin did something different compared to this, which basically is just Dark Bomb with a little different couple uh, tweaks. Um, that's my biggest problem with this whole set. And, you know, you're buying a bundle or a pack or whatever for the skins. You're not really buying it for the back things with pickaxes. The back of the pickaxes, I think, really suck this in this pack, too. I don't think they're anything special. They're very basic default pickaxes that have a little differences, um, and they look like similar pickaxes I've seen before. I've seen some of these, like, designs somewhere else before, personally, for me. Same as the backlings. They're very basic, very small, which I'm fine with small backlings, very basic backlings, but they're very basic. Like, all of them look almost identical. I always get confused on whose is which. I get to look at the name to see whose is which. That kind of sucks. So personally, I think this bundle kind of sucks. Um, but I really do like this skin. Um, which, 2,800 just for one skin. Kind of steep. Fuck these boars, man. These guys got to get damn vaulted. Um, but yeah, 2,800 for one skin. Uh, you really got to like, I think, all these skins to make it worth it. Um, but yeah, that's about it for the Crypt Crashers pack. Personally, I don't think you should buy it. Only if you like all these skins or all the items in here. But personally, I think it's kind of... A steep price compared to some of the other packs in the game at the moment and bundles that you can buy later down the line. But uh, yeah, that's everybody it for the Crypt Crashers back. Let's do the emote for the thumbnail. The look. Great emote. This is a really good emote. Um, I don't know if this is ever going to come back. But uh, yeah, that's everybody it. See ya.